Ireland is proving to be an attractive place for a pandemic. Just ask Matt Damon, who spent the past three months in Dawkey, a little village outside Dublin, and has described the experience as a fairy tale. So today's message is that we cannot be complacent and we cannot lose focus. Well, it has been strict. People can't go beyond a two kilometre boundary of their house, but there has been a very generous state at the other end. Leo Radker, the Taoiseach or Prime Minister, has given €350 Euro to the nearly 30% of people who are now unemployed in the country. Your sacrifices are making a difference. It has been necessary. Retailers are basically shut. Grafton Street, a busy thoroughfare, is ghostly quiet and the pubs aren't expected to open until August. This puts an awful lot of pressure on the large multinationals like Google, Facebook and Twitter that pay big taxes into the economy, hire people on big wages, but are now going to have to fit a big tax bill. Business leaders like Ryanair's Michael O'Leary are calling for the lockdown to end and end fast, but infection rates are low and the government would like to keep it that way. That conundrum is the biggest battle. But for now, sunshine like this is at least keeping Irish eyes smiling.